Hey guys, I'm back, and today I have a new custom LEGO minifigure showcase video. Today I have my two minifigures from the 2010 movie Super, uh, which is an amazing movie. I recently just watched it for the first time. It's by James Gunn, who did the Guardians of the Galaxy movies. Uh, today with me I have the two main characters from Super. I have Frank, oh shit, what's the last name? Frank Darbo right here, the Crimson Bolt, and I have Libby. I don't think she's given a last name in the movie, um, but I have Libby, a.k.a. Bolty, so we're going to take... Libby out of the way here, and then we're going to focus in on Frank, uh, the Crimson Bolt. So yeah, and let me just say, he probably has the best superhero catchphrase of all time, shut up crime. So that's like amazing. So yeah, uh, let me just get his accessories out of the way here. Um, uh, one, his first accessory is just a handgun. I don't know the exact type of model this is. I bought it off of Brick Arms. Um, let me just move the camera. There we go. I bought it off of Brick Arms, so I'm just going to take that out of the way here. Um, this shotgun is a le um, brick, uh, another Brick Arms accessory. Hang on, let me just... It, this figure's really fragile, so I just have to do this off-camera. It looks like this. Basically what I did is I took one of... Sorry, I should have prepared better. I should have prepared better. I took one of these shotguns and cut the barrel off of it. Or cut, cut the bottom, cut the back of it off. Because he uses a shotgun at the end of the movie. So yeah, there it is. And I couldn't find a shotgun without a barrel on Brick Arms, so I just did that. And uh, now we can talk about the actual figure. So yeah, uh, the head was. Ooh, hang on, there you go. Uh, uh, sorry, I'm just I'm just looking at this through a little viewfinder. So yeah, um, the head was entirely painted by me. It was an angry clone face, obviously. Um, everything was painted. Um, I did the little black square on the side because he has a he um, his costume is like very homemade. It's stitched together and stuff. So I did there, and I did that little stitch on the side. I didn't want to go. I didn't want to go too out of my way with um, with detail because this uh, is a uh, relatively simple figure. Um, the chest, I say that, and then the chest is probably my, the most detailed favorite part of the figure. So I have these electrical tape straps running from the top, uh, going to the back, from the top, down to the front, and then these, and it goes all the way down here, and this is all ammunition that he has. I did the Crimson Bolt from the final battle, from the final sequence at Jock's Mansion. Um, I was going to do the original one, like in the first and second act, where he's just the Crimson Bolt and he uses a monkey wrench. But I decided to go with this because I just like this a lot better. <clears throat> Painted the Crimson Bolt uh, symbol on the chest, and I think that turned out amazing. I really love how that turned out. And if you could see them, I did the silver the little silver dots because this is on a bulletproof vest now. Instead of just the costume, I did the silver nails in there. Then I have the two straps going down to the belt buckle right there, and I have the outline of the bulletproof vest right there. Yeah, and then I have some blood there, obviously, because he gets shot. Well, spoiler alert, he gets shot, but he doesn't die. Oops, sorry, I hit the camera. He gets shot, so yeah, I have the... <clears throat> sorry, the uh, blood stain right there. So here at the end... Uh, not the end, God damn it. At the back, we have um, the shoulder pad right there, he, uh, another shoulder pad. And I did the nails, I did the crimson outline, obviously. And then I did the, the six nails right there, and on the back... Same deal, six nails on the back, there, there, or four, is it four nails or six nails? Six, six nails, you can't really see them that well. There you can see them better on that side. Each arm is identical except for the fact that he has this knife. Now that is actually inaccurate. Um, he has this thing where he squeezes a little water, uh, not, uh, he squeezes this little balloon thing and his, I almost said water balloon, he squeezes this little balloon, like, air thing and it shoots out a little razor blade and he uses it to shoot Kevin Bacon in the nuts at the end of it at the end of the movie but um I just wanted to portray that because I really like I really like that little bit so I decided to put a little it was the front of a World War One rifle it was the front of one of these wet rifles and I cut off the uh, cut off the blade and then painted it silver so yeah the legs are <clears throat> Sorry my voice is so um, crappy today, but the legs are just regular um, legs. I painted them crimson, and I painted all those straps on there. Everything on this figure is 100% painted, if you couldn't tell, by the way. Did the bottom of the rims of the shoes, sculpted on a little holster right there for his knife, and uh, sculpted more stitch. I mean, not sculpted, painted more stitching there, there, and on the side of the leg right there. And, uh, yeah, that is basically it for the Crimson Bolt. I'll do one more 360 of him before... Uh, I go on to Bolty, so, oh yeah, and I did the gun holster in the back. Obviously it's non-functioning, but I did a gun holster in the back, because that's where he stores his gun. 
So, uh, yeah. Oh, and a little story to go along with this guy. James Gunn himself actually posted this figure on his Instagram story. If you go to my Instagram, and I have a little, I have a little story um, highlight. It's just called James Gunn, where I have super customs. And then I have the... He actually liked my picture, and he posted it on his story for 24 hours, which I'm... That, that made me so happy, because he's one of my favorite directors um, of all time. So, yeah. That's... Um, he makes really good movies. He did Slither, Super, and then the Guardians of the Galaxy movies. And he produced Brightburn and The Belko Experiment, which are two, also really good movies. So, yeah. That is the Crimson Bolt. And, uh, yeah. Now we're going to go on to Bolty. So here's Bolty, played by... Oh, dear. What's her name? Ellen Page. Ellen Page. Oh, yeah. I forgot to say that the... Uh, the Crimson Bolts, played by Rain Wilson. Uh, Bolty here is, um, I really like how this figure turned out. It's really simple, but effective. It's probably one of my favorite figures that I've made. Uh, the face was a Hobbit face. It was from the either Hobbit, Lord of the Rings, and I painted the lips. I painted, the, repainted the mouth, painted the eyes, painted, repainted everything except for the eyebrows. And I'm really happy with how this turned out. Uh, so yeah, that's what Li um, Libby looks like. I took one of these hair pieces, these, like, these long hair pieces, and it go in the, the hair piece actually goes down to about here. But then I repainted it, so so it, you know, so it's not as I mean not repainted it, cut it and then resculpted the end, so it's not as you know big. Um, so yeah, um, she, uh, to get her accessory out of the way, she has a pipe bomb with the crimson bolt, uh, lightning bolt on it, because that's what they use in the movie. And I will take that out of her hand. Here we go. And her hands are white because I'm running. I, I, I was gonna use black hands for this, but then her hand. Then I just figured I'd use white hands and paint them green. And the inside of the hands are gonna stay white, so she so she can grip stuff. And so what I did for the hands is I sealed, I painted them green, and then sealed them over because see, even if you rub it, the paint will come off. So yeah, uh, the uh, the same emblem on the front was painted. Uh, it's the exact same as the Crimson Bolts, um, except the mask is too small. I think it's a little too small. So I might touch that up a little bit, and I I'm just noticing it now that it's a little too small. So yeah. So just forgive me for that. Uh, the lines are painted on her chest to represent, or uh, to the chest, but the torso to represent the bulletproof vest and the little nails on the side. Uh, her costume is really not that detailed. Uh, she has the green boots on the bottom right there. And yeah, they go all the way around. And she has the green skirt um, that I used. Uh, I made it out of uh, green electrical tape. Uh, yeah, I was going to use yellow electrical tape and then cut out the... The crimson bolt symbols, um, the crim the bolt symbols, and the boltly, the crimson bolt symbols. But I just decided that was gonna be too much. And she has these claws on her on her um, left hand, um, which that was a huge mistake. She has them on both hands. Sorry about that. I cut those from a paper clip. Like I straightened out. Hang on. I straightened out a paper clip and then cut them from there. And in doing so, I actually cut the shit out of my hands right there, if you can see. Eh, it doesn't really pick up on camera. But I cut the shit out of my hands. Um, <clears throat> trying to cut them. So yeah, that is Boltly. There's really... Bolty, sorry. Is it Boltly or Bolt Bolty? I've... I never know, because I think she said Boltly once. She had a bunch of names. She had the... She had... Um, uh, Crimson Bolt. And Bolt... It was either Bolty or Boltly. Um... Crimson Bolt and a Kid Crimson, which is really, really good. A really good sidekick name. So, yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really have nothing to say. Um, I am so, so, so proud of these figures. Um, I'm I'm actually going to... I am I actually have them displayed next to my third-party superhero figures. Like, I have Kick-Ass and Hit-Girl. So, I'm ha I have them displayed next to them, which is cool. Which, it looks awesome. So, yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really love these figures. Thank you, um... <clears throat> Thank you, James Gunn. He's not going to watch this, but thank you, James Gunn, for posting my thing on your story. It really made my day. Um, and, yeah, I hope you guys have a good day, and shut up, crime. See ya.